the first time when our names were uh, printed on a black page of a newspaper. Uh, well, it, it kind of felt funny. When I'm in Slovakia, I fear all the time. Um, even in my professional, but also my personal life, because I have a boyfriend and every time uh, he goes and takes the bus to my place, I am scared. The people who I'm working with, they are mostly LGBTQ, members of the LGBTQ community, and they, they are afraid that they won't have the same life as I will have, that they won't have families, they won't have children. And they really want to have children and family, obviously. And the other thing is not, so I'm not afraid. I'm more like concerned that random people who don't even know me and don't know anything about me just hate me because I'm part of a party. And the government always tells them that this party is horrible and we want horrible things for Hungary and and they are basically telling them that we are the enemy. Uh, well, the, the, the populist uh, party came and put uh, an eti etiquette uh, down in the office door uh, saying uh, that this is an organization working for or helping uh, illegal um, migration. And that was also, well, ironic or, or, or sad in a, in a way because the house, we are renting a flat, which is our office, was, uh, was a house marked with a yellow star uh, when it was the, the old ghetto of Budapest. Honestly, I, you really can't allow yourself to fear things and to, to uh, think about fear and uh, and, 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 and having it as a part of your life because otherwise you cannot do the work that we are doing. So uh, I simply don't fear because that's the only solution. I fear about my personal rela relationships with my family because we don't see eye to eye on certain things. And I know that at one point in my life, I might just not be in contact with them because of this. But what's interesting about me that this fear is never an obstacle. A lot of times it triggers me even more. And I'm, and I'm very thankful for the fear because it also just makes me relate to people who perhaps are not in, in a such a good situation as I am.